I think it's done. Ah! Oh! <gasps> Number one. A nose ear trimmer with LED lights for your lover for Valentine's Day. How romantic is this gift? Listen, sometimes you gotta give them the necessities for Valentine's Day. Sometimes, you know what, you need it. Your hair is growing out your ears. <laughs> you got a bush growing out, growing out your nose. I'ma help you, because I love you. This is love. This is a love, <laughs> this is. <laughs> if you're gifted this, don't be offended, because they care. They're trying to keep you in check up to par, looking sexy at all times. That's a caring gift. Thank them, put a ring on it. $5 in the plus section at Dollar Tree. Let me know if that's worth it. I haven't seen these with an LED light for your ear bush or your nose bush at Walmart, have you? Or Target or anywhere. For five bucks, I'm gonna say it's already winning. And there's a picture of a dude right there. Only dudes put this up their nose, or is this unisex? You get a little cleaning brush, and then you get the cover. When we get to go on a cruise, take it with you. It is a stainless steel tip, which is always appreciated. It says definitely men. It's only for dudes. I'm not a dude, but I'm gonna try it anyway. Does that cut you? I'm gonna try it right here first. You know, to be honest, it kind of reminds me of the flawless brow. Can we use it on our brows? Can we use it on our armpit if we don't have that much hair or just a little bit? Ready? One, two, three, go. Do you guys see the light right here? That is loud though. Dollar Tree. If y'all can talk to this vendor right here, let them know your shit's loud and not discreet. Who knows what your mom's gonna think if they hear this in your purse or your gym bag. They're gonna kick you out of Bible study for sure. I'm nervous. I'm just gonna stick it like right there, right? Does it pinch? Am I gonna grow a bush now? I don't know. I got all kinds of urban legends going through my head, Mandela effects going through my head, all kinds of conspiracy theories going through my head if I use this once. So, I'm gonna try it anyway. Oh, my nose itches. I always say this in videos. Don't we need our nose hairs? Aren't they important? I'm sure we don't want a big old bush growing out of our nose. Just trim those with like a scissors. Those little baby scissors or those little like eyebrow scissors. Just trim that shit so it doesn't look like... <laughs> So it doesn't look like you're growing a damn mustache, trim them. But like getting this all the way up there like this, we're gonna stop using these because I'm saying we want to stop the fungalitis. And I feel like nose hairs are a shield, a protective shield against the fungalitis. It stops them, catches them, has little fingers, it catches. Does it make sense? Did anybody hear that in school? Back me up in the comments down below. But I'm gonna try it just for this video. Hopefully they grow back and I don't just have one empty hole and one hairy hole. <laughs> I wonder if it's less scary if you put it in your nose and then start it, or is it better to put it in your nose after you start, like now? I don't feel anything. It doesn't hurt. I don't feel any kind of pulling, nothing. So I'm gonna re-gift this, <laughs> that's gross. <laughs> I'm going to re-gift this to my brother. <laughs> I'm just kidding, brother. I'm not gonna re-gift it to you, but to my husband. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> so I'm gonna give the nose hair, ear hair trimmer with LED light. Three Vivian heads. Number two, Roma diffuser. You guys, at Dollar Tree, this was one dollar. Everything there is a dollar. What dollar store do you go to that has a diffuser? Water-free diffusing, battery operated and portable. Portable, where are you going with this? That's a cute gift. Stocking stuffer, if it works, it's a good one. And if it's not too cheapy looking, let's see. No, it's not horrible, but it's not the best quality. Ooh, it's a mess on the quality. Uh, you might have to do a couple of these, a couple, like a combo baggy set. My daughter let me try some of her essential oils. Ooh, I like cinnamon. Okay, so all you have to do is twist the bottom to remove the little tray. Then this little pad spongy thing, that's where you're gonna put your drops. Ooh, and it comes with two, nice. Can you wash these? <laughs> I mean, it was a dollar. Like, Vivian, you only need one. Save the other one for later when this one gets yuck. Couple drops in there. Can I just hold it? No, I shouldn't, because it's gonna be all over my hand. 
Oop, that's more than six. So it's gonna look like that. Just a couple drops will go a long way. It's just a little fan. Is that what a diffuser is? Is there a light on it? Why does it look like that on top? Is a diffuser just a little fan? Can we truly call this a diffuser? Okay, let's turn it on, ready? It's kind of loud. I put too much sun on it. It's too strong. Is it loud? Do you hear that crackly noise? Is the pad hitting it? Oh, the pad is moving. The pad is like getting sucked up by the little thing. Oh no, that's a fail. You see it right there? That little fan is sucking up that. Maybe you're supposed to put two. You know? I don't know, but I don't want it to suck up the little pad. It's hitting the fan, so it's making that weird noise. That's not very relaxing if you're trying to get some. You know, if you got the diffuser going to set the mood. You know what I'm saying? No. So I'm gonna say pass on it. Quality is not great. This looks like an LED light, but really it's just for decoration. And the little pad at the bottom is flopping around, hitting the fan, making noise. So I'm gonna give the diffuser, I don't wanna hate it because it's a dollar. So I'm gonna give the portable diffuser on Vivian head. I hate to do it. Number three. This is gonna be a little gift bag that you're gonna put together. That's a great gift for somebody at the office, for your lover, a stocking stuffer, for the neighbor. You know what this is good for? That emergency gift. You forgot and they got you something. And you're like, wait a second, let me go grab your gift. <laughs> this is a good thing. Throw it all together. It's like, here you go, it's for spa day and it's all watermelon. It's gonna cost you $5 plus the bag. And they got the whole setup here. This is a body oil. This is a facial toner. This is a facial mist, a paper facial mask. This is for Sunday spa day and a facial gel hydrator. On the airplane you're traveling, I never got the mist. What does it do? Just freshen your face? Like, do I look more glowy? The scent is not bad, but it's not, you, you miss the watermelon smell. Y'all could have put a little sticker on here so it doesn't look like Vivian's DIY. Now a little bit of oil. Massage night. Yes, let's see. Still no watermelon. I don't smell nothing. At least on my face, I smelled a little something. Sealed. I love that you guys seal stuff. A germaphobe like me thanks you for the extra step. Okay, just a little bit. Oh, that feels nice. Y'all gotta rework this flavor. Flavor, scent, you know what I mean. I'm gonna say skip this entire line because the scent is not there. So I'm gonna give each of these one Vivian head. Number four. Pineapple aloe vera facial wipes. It's pineapple. A dollar for 32 little face wipes. Some of you guys told me don't be using these on my face anymore. I'm like, why? They just became hip. So now they're not hip anymore. I can't keep up, you guys. Let's see. Remember that, ooh, that's nice. This stuff smells good. Ooh, you're gonna smell fruity for him. Yes, you are. Now this is only for your face, okay? Don't go wiping all kinds of stuff with this. Let me see. Smells gone already. I haven't had any luck with the brand, so I'm gonna just skip all of their products. So I'm gonna give the pineapple facial wipes one Vivian head. Number five. LA Color is sending all the good stuff over to Dollar Tree. How cool are these for a buck? They're like body paint on a stick. For your favorite team, for the kids' football game. You can be a cool mom and do your face. You could be JoJo Siwa. <laughs> For Halloween, somebody send her a goodie bag with some of these. These are way easier than doing the whole glitter with glue like she does. I Don't ask me how I know that because I watch her live streams. <laughs> these would be so much easier. LA Color, y'all need to get on that. Y'all need to sponsor that girl. I'm saying for the next soccer game, the kids are gonna be so excited when their mom shows up with fucking face full of glitter and looks like she wrote on her face with some lipstick. It comes in all kinds of colors. I got red, green, blue glitter, and gold. Only two have glitter. These are glitter sticks and then these are just colors. I want to try the glitter ones. Oh, how nice. Look at the blue. We're going to do swatches and everything. This was a good find for a buck. Now, it would have been nice. <laughs> I'm always asking for all kinds of stuff. Y'all need to go ahead and call uh, over to LA Colors headquarters and say, hey guys, y'all could have sent some templates, you know, so I can trace it. I need some stencils because I don't know freehand. I'm not an artist. Okay, swatches. How am I going to do this? Okay, call them back and just say cancel that order. Look at this. 
you're not gonna sponsor JoJo Siwa. <laughs> no, you're not. Her shit's good. You're gonna mess up her look. This is a mess. You can cancel that 18 wheeler order that I was about to put in. The f Literally broke. The glitter is not coming off and it's not blue. It's clear chapstick. Let's try this color. Very disappointed. I broke it. LA color, you're canceled. This is just lipstick. If you can't get this right, you should be out of the makeup business. This is for your face, not your lips. See, that's just lipstick though. Oh, look at that. The green though, it looks like it's not gonna be green. Like how come in the pictures that shit look real yellow? Look at this, it broke already. LA color, what are you doing? Okay, the green works. TV or VT? <laughs> Both. Okay, let's take this nose strip off. I think it's ready. It's not ready. Why is it sticky? Look, there's like glue coming off of my face. Is that normal for these? So I'm gonna give the LA Color Color Sticks Glitter Sticks zero Vivian heads. Total fail. Number six, nose strips. Remember when these were real trendy a couple years ago when they were first released? Wait a second, Dollar Tree. You only gave me two? <laughs> really? For a dollar? It works in 10 minutes. I haven't used one of these in forever. These things don't usually work unless you get the real expensive ones. At least I haven't had any luck with them. So let's see if these things work. Why are they so shiny? It always makes me think of a sticker. It smells like men's cologne. Okay, let's move on to the next product while we let this set or whatever, 10 minutes. I'm just gonna take this thing off my nose because it's been on for more than 10 minutes and it's still wet. Let's see, I think it's done. Ah! Oh. <gasps> Dollar Tree. Look at my nose. Do you see it? Don't say you don't see that. <laughs> you don't see that? What the f hell is this? It better come right off my face or we're about to have a fit if this stained my nose. It's glue. You can go ahead and skip these as well. Very disappointed in a lot of these products in today's video. So I'm gonna give the Global Beauty Care Nose Strips zero, vi shit, negative one Vivian heads. Number seven. Key cover. How cute are these? They're like unicorn dolphin looking thing. This is an actual animal, I think. I just made that up. <laughs> there is a dolphin that has a horn, right? I don't know what that's called. That looks like this. How cute is this? For your keys, so you know which one is the house key and you don't gotta like find it in your keychain. Boom, it's the one with the cute little silicone unicorn dolphin thing. Can't get that nowhere else. Two for a dollar. Super easy to use. You're just gonna insert your keys. Let's see how this is gonna work. One for each of the kids. They have to walk home from school. They can attach it to their backpack, but not to the outside of the backpack, to the inside in a secret location. You know what I'm saying? So people don't know they got the key to the house. Was I supposed to take this off? I'm thinking you need to take that off too. Yes, cute. And what you do is you see, the hole in the key goes right through the little hole there and then you just fish this little thing through again. It's all secure. Key's not gonna fall out of it. Oh, I love it. And they had different animals too. Cute things. <gasps> the kids are gonna love this. You can stash it somewhere in case you lose a key, in case the kids lost the key. Put it somewhere outside. That's not a good advice, huh? And it's not gonna fall out, look, because it's attached to the little metal Thingy. The silicone on them is not that great and it's probably just like a little plastic cover. So I'm gonna give the little silicone key covers three Vivian heads. Number eight. Serum or serum? Serum. One of those. With rose hip oil. Let's open this one now. I don't know if I would put oils on my face unless I'm going to wash them right off. Ready to use a face brightening. It has a list about 20 ingredients, but they're all, I think, essential oils. The smell is really nice. Let's see if it's oily. Oh, okay, let's see. It's, it's oily. I'd have to wash this off. <laughs> I'll do a double cleanse for this kind of thing, but it feels nice. It's just pure oil. Oh. It smells like the woods. <laughs> I think is that sandalwood, right? It's a bit strong to go on your face. As a personal preference, I'm not putting this on my face. I don't like oils on my face, number one. Number two, I don't wanna smell like I've been in the forest 
for days. So I'm gonna give the brightening one three Vivian heads. Number nine, candle making kit. I'm saying for the kids, but I don't know if that's like a fire hazard, but like a little party, the kids can do a little craft, take their mom a little candle home. Maybe the girlfriends come over. It's gonna be fun. Have some wine, watch some Netflix, laugh at the neighbors, whatever. Three different flavors. Magnolia, apricot, citrus, or apple cinnamon. Who, who the hell wants cin- Okay, y'all failed here. What's happening here? Who wants to mix apricot with apple cinnamon? Nobody on earth. Pretty basic. So you get your little glass, you get your little wax thing that goes on the bottom. Fill the wicked jar with your scented granules. Layer the granules to create a design or a pattern. Trim the wick, light and enjoy. You see what I'm saying? This is a three minute craft. <laughs> One glass of wine and y'all are done. Go home. That was nice. Same with the kids. All right, kids, call your mom and dads. They can come pick y'all up. Now, my little wick thing is not sticking. Can I put a little bit of wax here at the bottom or can I just light this like this? Probably not, don't do this. This is just Vivian being dumb. I just wanna heat that up a little bit so it'll stick. Ha ha, it worked. See, I know what I'm doing. I am a candle maker. You don't have to melt it or anything. So if they spill in the car, you're screwed. Close your eyes and vision. Old potpourri. Not apricots, not citrus. Mm -mm. Nowhere in there is that happening. <gasps> Cute! Oh, look at that! I'm halfway through the project. <laughs> I guess we'll put white in the middle. How crafty and creative am I, huh? It's not solid. So if the kids spill it or whatever, it's gonna make a mess. They get take, it's the same scent. Y'all are tricking me, Dollar Tree. I paid a dollar. I expect this to smell exactly like you're telling me. Who do we call? <laughs> you can't complain. For a dollar, you're getting all this? We're gonna light it to see how well this melts. Maybe when we turn it on, it'll all kind of mesh together and it won't be in these granules. Now the last layer, let me smell. Let me tell you of its old potpourri. Old potpourri. <laughs> you guys are silly. Just make it different colors and take the damn flavors off because it smells nothing like apples or citrus or apricots or nothing. I'm a little disappointed to be honest. Ready? One. I think they say cut that wick, but I'm not, I never cut it, do you? Tell me the truth, why do we cut the wick? Trim wick to a fourth of an inch before lighting. Next time. Is it gonna make my house smell like old potpourri? <laughs> there you go, what do you think? I just made a candle for $1 and in two minutes. It's cute, maybe a project to take to grandma. No, she ain't gonna like it either. I don't know who would enjoy it. Maybe the kids, they really don't care about stuff like this, but don't gift this to anybody. Um, I just wanna see what happens when the wax starts melting. Like, does it make one solid piece? I'm gonna blow out the little flame and then I'm gonna try to spill it. Are all these little granules gonna always just be loose? I need it to all be one solid piece. Somebody's gonna knock this over and they're gonna get punched in the neck. I think that's good, make a wish, ready? It's horrid, the smell. Only the middle is solid now, because it melted. How about this? Can we put it in the microwave for like 10 seconds so that they kind of melt together? Because to me, this is annoying. I don't want to worry about this spilling over. I don't want my microwave to smell now like <laughs> So this one, I'm gonna say pass on it. Dollar Tree, I don't know who works in your scent research and development department, but their nose is off. You need to fire them. Or at least move them from that department because they don't know what apricots smell like or apple cinnamon or magnolias. Unless you make them just like non-scented right? Then who cares? So I'm gonna give the do-it-yourself candle from Dollar Tree one. Vivian head. Number 10, glow in the dark snowflake headband. You guys know their party section is amazing at Dollar Tree. The makeup beauty section, I love it. The craft section, better than Hobby Lobby. And they have a really nice selection of these glow stick things, <laughs> but they have balls. All the toys, they make them in these glow in the dark glow sticks things. It's a headband. Party, a concert, now that everybody's going outside again. 4th of July? Oh, how cute is this? 
this look? Is that gonna go in the dark? The glow sticks are in here. Okay, you get two. Oh, this is pretty basic. It's not gonna be fancy. For the kids, ooh, a spooky night outside. Here's where we think outside the box. You decide you're gonna go jog at night. Please have something on that's reflective. Wear your little headband. Have you seen those people jogging at night? <laughs> and you're like, sir, I can't even see you. Why are you jogging at 10 a.m.? <laughs> Throw him a headband. Be nice. Buy some. Have them in your car for those people jogging at night. Install. That's for a little baby head, not for <laughs> my big old head. You're going to put one on each side of the little headband thing. I want this to light up all the way. And then this goes somewhere here. Sit on. <gasps> Look how cute. Let me see. Oh, Vivian, you're so cute. <laughs> Can you guys see it? Is this glowing? I can't tell. Let me take it off for a second. Mm, you failed me, Dollar Tree. I was like, this is so cute and such a great idea, but you can't even see my little snowflake. You can just see the bandana, which is fine. I mean, this will work while we're jogging, but the little side snowflake was everything. I'm disappointed. Y'all needed to put some juice in here and let me snap it. Aw, the kids are not gonna love that because you need the snowflake. Otherwise, just throw the snowflake away. That's a waste. It's not doing anything. I thought it was gonna Get kind of the glow from the sticks it didn't so i'm gonna give the snowflake headband two vivian heads number one rose oil infused cosmetic swabs q-tips i mean not for your are they okay to put in your ears if they are infused with rose oil? Hopefully, if you are using these for like makeup or something, hopefully your face doesn't smell like rose oil all day. You know what I mean? Do not enter the ear canal. All Q-tips give you that warning and you should follow that warning. Perfect for personal care, makeup application, nail polish, touch up, and more. Now there is 50 in here for $1. That's pretty good. Hey, I'm wearing the perfect uh, cute.com shirt for rose oil Q-tip thing. It's for your face too. It's for whatever you want to use them for. They come in this cute little plastic container, which I think it's perfect for like travel, right? Like a little travel kit thing. I would put all kinds of stuff in here though, not just Q-tips, like half Q-tips, then you got some Band-Aids, some all kinds of stuff fit in here. Do you guys think it's gonna smell like rose or what? Ready? Oh, that's really nice. And it has the perfect amount of fragrance on them. It actually has nothing. I only smelt just enough when I did that. Now I'm not wearing any makeup. I just noticed myself <laughs> on my monitor down here. And it is because today is spa day here at Vivian Tri's Dollar Tree store. And um, a lot of the stuff is going on my face. So I decided not to put on any makeup because I was gonna take it off anyway. So that's why I look like this. Not just because I wanted to go all natural. Let me tell y'all the trick with Dollar Tree. Any fragrance or perfume or anything, candle, anything that I've purchased from them, in the past, it's literally a one second sniff rule. After two seconds, it's it's gone, it flew away into the air. I gotta close it, because it's gonna escape. I wonder if the box is what's scented, because <laughs> you guys know I'm a <laughs> you guys know I'm a professional s smeller. This smells like nothing. You see what I'm saying? Are they tricking me? They only like put the fragrant on the box. The box. <laughs> I'm gonna sniff everything now. See, when I go like that, I can kind of smell it. Let's see if they feel oily. Nope. Let's see if my hand smells like oil now that I'm rubbing these around. Let's be fair, rub it good. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I mean, they were a dollar for 50, that's pretty good. So you can just pretend like they smell like something. I thought that, you know, you're gonna be able to rub it on your face, you know, take a little bit of mascara off or eyeshadow, clean up your brows or down here, maybe your mascara ran. And then, <laughs> and then you're, that's so weird. Just put it to my nose to smell it. It's what I do though. I enjoy smelling things. Let me know in the comments down below if you're a weirdo like me. I know some of you guys are cause you told me in other videos. So for those reasons, I'm gonna give the rose infused Q-tips to Vivian heads. Number two. Natural under eye serum. It is a roll-on applicator for underneath your eyes. We've tried this company before, but not for this product. See, it comes in this rolly kind of bottle. Come on. 
and I don't want smells either. I can't do it that hard on my face, you guys. I'm gonna hurt myself. No, can't do it. I can't recommend it because, do you see how hard I'm having to push here to drag it for anything to come out? Barely anything. This skin is very delicate, so pushing this hard or dragging it is the biggest no-no ever. What I would do is put it on my finger and roll it and get some of that oil on your finger. Also, if you wear eyelashes, you know, or even eyeliner, oil is gonna take it off. So this is gonna be on days that you have no makeup, like today for me. I don't hate it, I don't love it. So I'm gonna give the under eye serum rolling thing to Vivian Heads. Number three, green tea clay mask. Who doesn't love a good face mask? And I heard green tea was really good for your face, anti-aging, blemishes. They had a whole line of this green tea stuff. One dollar, you guys, I'm always so impressed. Listen, if you work at Dollar Tree, let us know the scoop down in the comments below because I need to know what you guys are doing over there. I've seen the craft section blow up, the beauty section blow up, and the skincare totally blow up. They've really stepped up their game, haven't they? Look at that. Okay, let's take these off first so that I can put my clay mask on. Let's see. I think we just, oh, dude, go get some of these crystals. You're gonna love them. Look how easy they are to take off. Now the glue though, the glue that's left behind. I know. I don't know how they will hold up in a pool or something like that, but so far for the time that I had them on, I'm gonna highly recommend them. I'm gonna go ahead and keep my five Vivian heads for this one. I am impressed with it. Let me show you guys. Oh, it feels so nice. I'm gonna put some on my arm so you guys can see it. It feels like whipped cream. Why am I rubbing it like this? It does have some kind of perfume in it. Y'all need to cut that out. When I think of clay masks, I think of masks that are actually gonna dry. Clay masks, I want them to like suck out all kinds of gunk, don't you? Now that I have it on my face, I don't smell it as strong, the perfume smell. Okay, so it's been a few minutes and it's actually drying really nicely. Now, there's no pulling or anything like that, like I was hoping, but at least it's not staying like sticky and gooey. You know, sometimes you put on a face mask or a clay mask and you take it off and you're like, wow, my face looks like refreshed and like a little brighter. And I'm not getting that vibe with this one. It just feels like I'm wiping my face with water. That's really it. I don't see any brightening. I don't see my face feeling like refreshed or anything. So that's a little bit disappointing, but maybe with time you'll see a little bit better results, but just a one-time treatment, I don't think so. So I'm gonna give the Tea Tree Clay Mask to Vivian Heads. It's okay. Number four. Pro Therapy Ionic Face Massager. Now, the reason I picked this up, not only because it was $5 in the $5 plus section of Dollar Tree, and it is an anti-aging skincare product, which I am absolutely obsessed with, but I also picked it up because I've seen this exact product at Walmart. It is a little vibrating gadget that you rub on your face to help absorb or penetrate the skin with moisturizer. It has a just a gentle ionic massaging technology. <laughs> I don't know if these kind of ionic things work. I had to pick it up because I have seen this thing for like 30 bucks. Doesn't look very fancy or very expensive. If you paid $5, keep that in mind. It does feel very cheap and plasticky. Okay, so it has one of those flat batteries inside. It broke. We've exposed the ionic technology. What the hell? <laughs> it mentions this little plate here in the back of it as a sensor plate. This is interesting. They're saying you can use it not just for absorption, like I had mentioned in the beginning of this. They're saying you can also use it for cleaning. So apply the cleanser onto the face and then turn on your massager to positive mode, sliding it up. Oh, so when it's a green light, it's positive. And then when it's a red light, it is negative. Never use while sleeping. <laughs> How? Never drop or insert object into any opening. 
Huh? People ordering from Wish again? These sound like instructions from Wish. Do not operate while aerosol products are being used or administered. I'm scared. Do not operate under a pillow or blanket. Do not perform any services on this product. If you're trying to start a spa, they're letting you know this is not for you. All that made a whole lot of no sense. I have a little bit of moisturizer here. I'm not gonna clean my face. It's just an experiment right there. We're gonna do up for the positive. Okay, now down, negative. Very gentle on the red down position, the negative. I just feel like just leave it off, rub it around, it'll get in there. <laughs> the only difference that I'm hearing, I'm not feeling any difference. One is louder than the other, otherwise it's pretty much the same thing. So just rub it around. I'm not too impressed with this one. I think it's super basic. I always feel like these vibrating ionic things for your face are very gimmicky kind of. Some are kind of okay, some are like, what the hell? That ain't doing nothing to my face. I'm kind of on the fence with these things. I really haven't found one that has blown my socks off. So I'm gonna give the Pro Therapy Ionic Face Massager from Dollar Tree to Vivian Heads. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!